the summer and then during season we'll kind of keep it steady around for myself it's like around 80 to 90 miles a week and then uh, the past two weeks leading up to conference we try to bring it down a little bit and so uh, it's kind of nice right around now because we're quarter mileage so it's uh, a lot less time consuming and your body's uh, starting to get into racing shape so workouts seem easier and you get things faster and it gets pretty exciting about the Just an awesome experience for I think all the guys that, that got to go. Um, just really cool, just to, from a runner's perspective, or just to, any kid's perspective. Just growing up, um, you've seen all those big name schools, and uh, finally you're now in college and you get to see like, all these Division One big ranked teams all around you. It's just a huge adrenaline rush. It's super exciting, uh, and you see these great athletes that you. You hear about, you talk about, and uh, and then you get on the starting line with them. It's just an, an awesome experience. So I mean, pre nationals is something that I'll be able to take away and uh, just remember forever. NBC meet last year was kind of uh, I won't say I was an underdog, but there was definitely a lot of people in the hunt. Just kind of if it was a tactic, race tactics went out in a certain way that benefited me or if it went out a different way it benefited somebody else. Um, but it, it, it kind of worked out uh, for me and uh, I was able to have a lot of success that day. Um, and coming into this year, um, NBC is just as deep. There's a lot of a lot of contenders plan is to hopefully do just as great of things as I did last year, um, try to take control of the race and uh, hopefully can have the same success as I did last year. I really don't have a specific one, it's just every runner or every athlete, I guess I wouldn't say every athlete, but every runner has the same respect for everybody and we're all doing the same thing and trying to reach our goals. Um, it's not like football where one person is trying to attack the other guy. Running is more of a you're trying to excel for yourself, and it's more personal. And everybody is very supportive, other teams, and uh, it's just awesome to see higher end level athletes who are doing some big things that work really hard. And uh, it, you, you know, it's all reachable it's, as long as you're putting in the work and the time and all the little things. So I don't say I wouldn't say there's a certain athlete that inspires me. I mean, it's just the accumulation of everybody doing the sport of running. It's just exciting. So like my dad, it's 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 fun to watch him, see him get better, see him get PRs. Um, finally ran a marath Boston Marathon qualifying time, which was pretty exciting. And my younger brother is just doing some amazing things. Um, one of the best runners I was ever seen and uh, it's just all the little things of running is just super exciting and uh, I'm just glad to be involved in this sport. Expectations for Saturday is uh, coming into the season we were uh, expecting to hopefully get a team title this year and we've had some injuries and setbacks and uh, we've had to modify our goals a little bit but I think all of us have some pretty high standards as to how we're going to finish. So, um, just overall, hopefully, we can hit some PRs and uh, do pretty well as a team. We've got a pretty experienced team now, just uh, quite a few juniors, a senior, and uh, some sophomores, and then uh, one freshman. And uh, we've, we've all been around the block um, running some cross country races. and. I mean, it's the important part is just uh, we just need to stay honest with ourselves and uh, make sure the race is how we want it and not according to the other teams. Um, so if we go and stick with our racing strategy, we should uh, be pretty successful.